today we had a customer ship out their parts from across the world to get them diagnosed. I told him I would cover the labor and the diagnostics since his shipping came out to over $150. He had mentioned he got his PC a few years ago and it was running fine until it just stopped turning on. He narrowed the problem down to be either the motherboard, the processor, or the RAM. So to save on shipping, he sent just this and not the entire PC itself. The first thing I do to test it is plug in my external power supply, get in all the cables, and turn it on. I can see right away that the PC is not even lighting up or turning on at all. This is usually a sign of a dead motherboard or a dead CPU. So to test the motherboard, I'm going to go ahead and plug his RAM and his CPU into my own test bench. Everything turns to life. The problem that I'm seeing is that the VGA light on the motherboard turns on and I get no display. His processor is a 3200G, which comes with the graphics built in. Since my test bench turns on, I can rule out that he definitely has a faulty motherboard, but now his processor isn't working. I go ahead and I plug my 5700G in and it turns to life. Just to make sure that his motherboard is 100% fried, I went ahead and I put my 5700G and booted it up. Again, no signs of life. Unfortunately for our viewer, his motherboard and CPU are both dead, but at least his RAM is working.